The Bill Collins has turned into uh, a different sort of race with no Tornado Valley, who might have been able to come out and roller skates and test for the front. He's not there. And it really is going to be a race for the lead between three horses, but more than likely two. So one, two, and three, Red Hot Tooth, Big Jack Hammer, and Tough Monarch are all quick beginners. So too is McLovin wider on the front line. But the intimidation factor and the reputation that uh, Tough Monarch fortified in winning in 153.7 at his last short course start at Tabcourt Park, Melton Means, I think he'll be able to go up and ask the question of Red Hot Tooth and Zach Phillips and say, look, you're first up from a break. We're hard fit. We're rolling on to the top now. Your best chance is to try and sit on us. <clears throat> if that happens, I think Tough Monarch will lead and win the race. The Red Hot Tooth is a Group 1 winning mare. She's a star, and I reckon from behind the leader, she can definitely strike a blow. Uh, definitely be in the finish at least. I think she's a clear second pick. McLovin will be up outside the leader in transit. Now the Tornado Valley, his stable mate, won't be there. He's a very, very good horse, McLovin, but he's got some pretty big fish to fry in New Zealand soon. And even if he races at his absolute best, I think being in the breeze outside a horse like Tough Monarch will be a bridge too far. <clears throat> big Jack Hammer, I think, will have a little dip at the start, but if he's not really in the hunt and the one and the three are, um, are beginning too well for him, I think... Kima Frenning will be happy to drift back early and then come with one run late, hoping they've gone quickly enough in transit that they can use their turn of speed, which they really do possess. Maori Law will also be coming from the back. So too will cruising around, in my opinion. And the American Mayor Lily Stride, first up on Victorian soil, also trying to come from well back in transit to win. Tough Monarch, I reckon, will be in front. The only way that doesn't happen is, ex is if Zach Phillips and Red Hot Tooth have different ideas. But under my map, Tough Monarch in front, Red Hot Tooth behind the leader, and McLovin doing all the work outside the lead.